Hello and welcome to the Dr. Kate series. Today we're going to be looking at more seizure triggers and focusing especially on aspartame. Many people think that cutting out sugar is helpful and therefore they use artificial sweeteners. However, looking at aspartame as one of the sweeteners, we're going to see that many of them include neurological effects. Aspartame especially may alter brain neurotransmitters. These are the chemicals within your brain, such as dopamine, which helps to motivate you, and serotonin, otherwise known as your happy hormone. Normally, when we study a drug or a food, the company that manufactures it donates the product to researchers because they're proud of the benefits or safety of their products. However, the manufacturers of these artificial sweeteners refused to sell it to researchers. The data had been, up until then, controversial and inconsistent, but researchers managed to get their hands on aspartame, and within a week, there were significantly more adverse effects reported in the aspartame group as opposed to the placebo group. Scientific opinions range from safe to unsafe at any dose. In a review of the direct and indirect cellular effects of aspartame on the brain, it has been noted that there are reports of aspartame causing neurological as well as behavioral disturbances, such as headaches, insomnia, and seizures themselves. Aspartame is composed of three main ingredients, phenylalanine, aspartic acid, and methanol. Phenylalanine plays an important role in regulating our brain chemicals, whereas aspartic acid is thought to be excitatory within the central nervous system. As one can imagine, this is not beneficial for people with epilepsy. Hence the impact such as headaches, insomnia, and seizures. It also, these compounds also inhibit chemicals such as dopamine, norepinephrine, which helps to control our adrenaline, and serotonin. It's also been known to lead to impaired memory, anxiety, and depression. Therefore, when thinking about using sweeteners or sugar alternatives, please think very carefully about which ones you're choosing to use. Thank you. I hope you're enjoying the Dr. Kate series. Please feel free to follow me on drkatehealthcoaching.com.